What if everything we think we know about ancient human diets is wrong? For years, we imagined early humans as simple hunters, surviving on nothing but meat, or as gatherers, picking berries and chewing on roots. But new discoveries are changing everything. From surprising foods that shaped our evolution to bizarre meals you'd never expect. What did our ancestors really eat? And could their diets hold the key to better health today? Let's uncover the truth. The term paleo diet suggests that ancient humans lived off nothing but meat, but that's not exactly true. Yes, early humans were skilled hunters, bringing down massive animals like mammoths and bison. But they were also opportunists, eating whatever they could find. In some regions, meat made up a huge part of their diet. In others, nuts, seeds, tubers, and even honey were just as important. In fact, evidence shows that Neanderthals, our closest extinct relatives, ate cooked grains and roasted vegetables thousands of years before farming even existed. So, was the real Paleolithic diet more balanced than we thought? Here's something that might shock you. Despite the popular belief that ancient humans ate low-carb diets, researchers have found that early humans relied heavily on carbohydrates. Studies on ancient teeth show star residues, suggesting that humans were eating tubers, wild grains, and even grinding seeds into flour as far back as 30,000 years ago. Some researchers even believe that carbohydrates fueled the growth of our massive brains, giving early humans an advantage over other species. Could it be that our ancestors didn't avoid carbs, but thrived on them? Long before the concept of superfoods, ancient humans were already seeking out the most nutrient-dense foods they could find bone marrow, and organ meats. Early humans didn't just eat muscle meat, they cracked open bones for marrow, ate liver, heart, and even brains, packed with essential nutrients. Fermented foods. Some evidence suggests that prehistoric humans fermented fruits and honey into alcohol tens of thousands of years ago. Fermentation also made food easier to digest and preserved it for longer. Insects. While it may sound unappetizing, early humans regularly ate bugs, a rich source of protein, fats, and essential vitamins. Many of these foods are still considered some of the most nutritious on the planet. So, have modern diets lost something important? While hunting was crucial, not all ancient humans ate the same way. Some groups, especially those in tropical regions, had mostly plant-based diets, surviving on fruits, nuts, and roots. One surprising discovery, some ancient human populations ate mostly seafood, getting their protein from fish, shellfish, and seaweed instead of land animals. In fact, some scientists believe that our early ancestors' love for seafood helped develop bigger brains thanks to the high levels of omega-3s. So could it be that different environments created completely different human diets? Imagine trying to survive without fire. Before humans mastered cooking, eating was dangerous. Raw meat carried parasites. Tough plants were nearly impossible to digest. But when early humans discovered fire, everything changed. Cooking made food safer, more nutritious, and easier to eat. Some researchers believe this led to shorter digestive tracts and bigger brains, allowing us to evolve even further. But here's the question. What foods did humans start cooking first? Ancient human diets weren't one size fits all. They adapted to their environment, eating what was available, experimenting, and even creating the first superfoods. And yet, modern diets have strayed far from what our bodies evolved to handle. So, should we be eating more like our ancestors, or have we lost something along the way? If you love unraveling the secrets of human history, subscribe, because the past still has so much to teach us.